Hi, welcome back to Weekly Words. My name is Alicia, and this week we're going to talk about ways to say hi. This should be fun. Let's get started. First is yo. <laughs> this one is a little bit casual, in case you couldn't tell. Used for close friends, maybe family members, if you have kind of a silly relationship with them. Just quick, short, easy to do. In a sentence, yo, how's it going? Howdy. Howdy, uh, traditionally associated with cowboy culture, I suppose. You should play a banjo, maybe, or you've just gotten off a horse. I don't know. I use howdy from time to time. Howdy. 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 Yeah. Dun, 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 dun. That was my banjo. <laughs> yeah, in a sentence, you might say, Howdy, folks. Welcome to the barbecue place. <laughs> Next is hey. Hey is a good, friendly phrase. You can usually use hey with a wave and smile, look happy. If you don't, people might think that you're down in the dumps. People might think you're not in a very good mood. In a sentence, hey, uh, I heard you got uh, engaged last week. Congratulations. Something like that. It's usually kind of a cheery, happy expression. All right, next is what's up. Uh, what's up is the long form of sup. This does not literally mean what is above you right now. If you want to be funny, you can say the ceiling or the sky, but that joke gets old really fast and chances are the person you're talking to has already heard it before. It just means what are you up to? What is going on with you? In a sentence, what's up? Did you have a good weekend? Typical response to what's up is not much. Find out some more responses in English in three minutes. We did an episode on this. Nothing much. How about you? That's pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, the next one is long time no see. You can use this when you haven't seen the other person for a long time. You're at a party or an event or whatever. Anytime it's been a long break. You can decide how long long is. Not the day before or the week before. Maybe a few weeks or a month. Whatever's unusual for you and this other person. When you see them, you can say, hey, long time no see, how have you been? Uh, that's the end, so those are a few different ways to say hi in a few different situations. I hope that you have a chance to try them out the next time you meet someone or you greet someone. Thanks very much for joining us this week, and we'll see you again soon. Bye! <laughs> Instead of saying sup, I like to say soup. Sup. Soup? <laughs>